Alright everybody, this is going to be some Master at Arms gameplay inside of Gears of War Judgment. Uh, Master at Arms is a new game type that just came out this week. You can only find it under the VIP list, so basically if you have the season pass in any way, shape, or form. Um, basically the game type is get a kill with uh, at least 20 weapons in the, in the game. They usually choose, uh, they choose it for you right away with uh, <clears throat> starting out with Lancer and everything like this, and then you just progress to the end, which is the, the final weapon, and I believe is the cleaver. Uh, honestly, I like this game type, mainly because it's a good chance to practice with some uh, potential weapons that you don't use at some point in time in the match, and you can uh, learn them a little bit better. And also, it also does kind of show if you have any kind of skill with other weapons other than just your typical starting weapons. Oh wow! <laughs> I didn't realize I just got a kill with the with the uh, Nasher that far away. I thought I was still trying to get a kill with the Nasher, there, so I just shot a boom shot right away. And as you can see, it just switches you directly to the next weapon. And I think this is this is probably one of the better game types that they've come up with. Since, uh, since the you know beginning of Gears Judgment, uh, the special event game types have not been too thrilling to me, but this has been a lot of fun. So let's see if I can do uh, if I can actually get to the cleaver. No, Ooh. okay, you can make that shot. Like it. Okay, that's the first time I've been retrocharged. I have not realized how little damage that actually does do. I knew they reduced the damage for it, but... Nope. <laughs> Mauler might be a little bit of a problem for me. Come on. Damn. <laughs> trying to get that guy, but he ended up getting me with the boom shot. With the boom shot. Like I said, I expect the mauler to ha have a little bit of a problem with me for me. Oh, I didn't do a lot. I didn't do barely any damage to that guy. Got him. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Nice, nice shot of the breach shot there by him. I'm probably just going to play three games of this. Missed my reload and then I went out there stupidly too fast. Oh wow. <laughs> it's always hilarious to watch someone blow up right in front of your face. I totally ganked that kill from that guy. <laughs> Yeah, this is definitely, like I said before, this is definitely a lot more fun of a, of a, well, uh, was it free-for-all game type than, of course, the typical free-for-all and uh, just most of the other game types in here in general. I'm still, I'm still sad by the whole no down but not out deal, but that's, I guess it's just going to have to be come, uh, come expected with this game, with the exception of Execution, which honestly is still probably the best game type in it. Though this is a close second. This is a lot of fun. 
Just because you get to see so many different weapons, it's not just all one type of weapon. This is another weapon I'm going to expect to have some problems with. In that case. Ouch. Suicide! Oh, wow, that sent me back to the long shot. I thought it only counted, if, or it only sent you backwards if you had suicide with a weapon, not just a general suicide. I should not have missed that headshot. A little late on that long shot. I landed right in front of him. That's hilarious. Stop that guy with a cleaver truck from getting his kill. Uh, oh, he ended up getting it anyway. Alright, I'm going to do about two more games of this. I really like this game type, so hopefully you're enjoying it too. See you in the next game.